Hey, Maximum, it's Swamp Tooth here. Anyway, uh, this is what I've been able to figure out with Caravi. So one of the first things that you want to do, I'm using Sonar X64, by the way. Uh, so some of the MIDI automation that you were talking about isn't really working on my system because it's doing a path through, pass through. But anyway, so one of the first things that you have to do is come down to the Cakewalk Plugin Manager. Go ahead and open that up. Caravi would be in VST audio effects, but one of the things that you have to do is turn it into an instrument. So right here you can see it's down here in the instruments list. The way you do that is you click on Caravi, click option, oops, sorry about that, um, plugin properties. And then this little guy, configure as a synth right here, you want to have that checked. You don't want to have configure as tempo based effect and that will allow you to send MIDI notes through it. I think you've already gotten that far, I'm not really sure. I'm gonna go ahead and close out the plugin manager. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna insert an instance of Caravi. And I'm gonna play a little bit of the sample. I'm not sure how it's gonna sound on this system. I'm using my laptop microphone. You can see the waveforms popping up there and all that kind of stuff. So if you can do automatic transposing, you would adjust the scale setting and what the root note is. But you can take that off by unchecking scale, which is what I would recommend. Just having kind of used this a few times. Anyway, I'm going to close out Kirby and stop that. And then I'm going to insert a MIDI track. And I am going to root this to Caravi. And what I'm going to do in the MIDI track, just really simply, I'm going to draw some notes. Let's do this guy, this guy. Let's put another one there. Bum, bum, bum. Just for the heck of it. And then this is just a demo so I can show you what's going on. Go back to the beginning. Let's go ahead and loop this. So it'll just kind of progress through the whole sequence. And I'm going to bring Caravi up again. Hit start. And what you can see is every time one of those notes comes on, it's going to trigger on the note that it's rounding down to or that it's actually doing the transposition to. And I think you can hear it. So I guess that's what you're trying to do, I'm not sure. Anyway, if that helps, I've been playing around with Caravi a little bit today um, since you posted about it. It's kind of cool. And I'm hoping to learn a lot more about it, but I hope this helps you a little bit in the meantime. Anyway, have fun. Bye.